Shab? No, who the? He's actually popping around the league. One of the biggest ones in Montreal right now. Is he? What's his name? Mike Shop. Mike Shop. He's very animated, you know what I'm saying? He's a very animated artist. I could tell by his, his beat selection or this one right here. He's he's definitely on that on that wave of being very vibrant with the sound, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Like just being very creative with the shit. So I see what he on, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to him too. You know his shit, yeah. That shit hard. Yeah, this guy's uh He's repping Montreal hard right now. He's one of the biggest in Montreal right now. We're, we got a couple. I of, love Montreal, man. Montreal. Yeah, Montreal, bro. The scene, the scene here is like. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. It's good. The only thing about like Montreal rappers, like it's when you're starting off, it's hard to like to like get yeah, out yeah. there to really yeah. like because there's a lot of rappers, but there's not a lot of like uh, there's not a lot of ways to get exposed to like like the mainstream. I know what you mean. That's the one thing. I know what you mean. So we're trying to we're trying to bring that here. Yeah, yeah. So we have a couple more. We have this is Kid Riz. Yeah, like AP. Uh, gotta get this trick cause they don't know me. Uh, fucking on the studies on a daily. Uh, get it to this money, it's too easy. It's too easy. Like AP. Uh, gotta get the trick cause they don't know me. Uh, get it to this money on a daily. On a daily. Like Stacy. Uh, when I got my ice, you wanna fuck me. Uh, who, was, who was the artist before? The artist before was Mike Shab. Mike Shab. Yeah. And this is this is Kid Riz. Kid Riz. Yeah. Kid Riz and Mike Shab, they, they have a lot of similarities. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah, they, they sound similar. They sure. have a lot of similarities. They sound similar, but not in a bad way. Just yeah. Like, they should make a camp and be a part of that camp together. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Yeah. He's dope though. This, this guy's fire. He sounds like Shabazz, King King Shab. Mike Shab. Mike, Mike Shab. Shab. Mike Shab's brother. <laughs> it's the last one, bros. My Let's personal, my personal favorite, okay. CJ Fleming's. My approach is way too different. I stop it. Count the money, I need all the profit. Double cross me, I ain't gon' forget. I don't ever miss. Hit him with a switch. Why you acting like I never took a hit? Exactly what I'm doing here. If I gotta leave the city, tryna do a big small town. I've been planning out the music biz. Shout Toronto, man, you know I got the new connect. Y'all is getting swift like turbulence. Y'all don't wanna start. Nah, booming, I'm a titty. Who is it? CJ Fleming. CJ Fleming. He's lyrical, you know what I'm saying? He yeah, he's more lyrical. He definitely that. picks up a book, you know what I'm saying? Fast. Engages him, like, he engages his mental. He's, he's a smart guy. Very smart guy. Oh. This is hard. My personal favorite is, is, is Mike Shabazz. Yeah, Mike, Mike Shab, Mike Shab. Mike, Mike Shab, I keep saying Shab. Mike, <laughs> Mike Shab, you know what I'm saying? A track that he has is fire, you know what I'm saying? But that one right there, that's definitely like my second. That was your second? And, and Mike Shab's brother. Oh, uh, that was uh, Kid Riz. Kid, Kid Riz? Yeah. That's my third. That was your third? Yo, yo, this your boy Flip the Narrow, man. One track, mom, while the gang, yo. Let's get it. If I was broken, I was you, I probably had